You are now listening to 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Let's go! Alright, man, 15 Minutes of Fame. 40 bars. What's up, beautiful? How are you? Looking good. We're trying to, but you know my eyelash keeps acting stupid. I'm not fixing it, so. Nobody can even see that. And if anybody sees it, they looking for the wrong damn they thing. They do be. Look, they do be. I know. Like a rat. They do be. <laughs> I talk with them. What's good? How you feeling? I feel good. I'm a little good. hot. I feel good. I feel good. You see me on these battle rap streets again. That's a fact. That's a fact. What yeah. was the last time we saw you? Was it was it official? It was official. Yeah, um it was official. Well, I had, um, I battled a one, I had a, a failed battle in December with Rebel Warzone. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, so, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, you got smacked on your ass. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Didn't sit too well. But, uh, you, you fire on B2. I think a lot of people don't, don't, uh, don't know that or don't remember when, um, you know, you, you do, uh, music, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? And you fire on B2, so... That's the first time you did Verbal was on. Yeah, it was. Yeah. Actually, I hope I can get to go back. I mean, they definitely were super dope or whatever as far as I'm pretty sure I do welcome back because I ain't do shit. But, um, yeah. Yeah, I liked it over there. As much as I love the authentic no-beat battles, the on beat battles be fired too. They do. Yeah. They do. They're like, it's something different. Like, you know, we've... um. With all due respect to, you know, the forefathers of bad rap and stuff, we've been watching that certain format for so long. So it's like with anything, when you when you already love a sport and then you tweak it or you add a certain element. And then people have been rapping on beat for battles for years. So to actually bring it into the sport of battle rap instead of it just being, a, you know what I mean, something that happens too. Like, I, th I definitely think it's dope. I definitely, I had a good time with it. I mean, clearly despite the bullshit, but I still had a good time. Like, I liked, I liked it. It's all good. Mm -hmm. um, I'm, I'm not going to uh, dance around right now. June 26. You didn't tell me my pockets was up. June 26, you got KCJ. KCJ has me. <laughs> okay. Let's start there. All right. Let's, <laughs> let's, um, let's start. There. And they just, I think they just announced this like yesterday or something. So, mm -hmm. um, how long did you know that this battle was actually set up? Uh, about a week. Oh, so. Oh, okay, okay. It's been that long. Um, there was some talk, but um, I, I want to say I sent my contract back. Like, what's today? My contract's been back for like maybe three days. So maybe like maybe about a week or something like that. Did this have anything to do? Like, did this battle uh, happen because of the uh, the the? I think Smack said that KCJ is the face of female. So did something? brew after that and then they say yo we gotta set this battle up like how did the battle actually get set up and why i'm pretty sure that's a narrative that helped them sell that helped sell them the battle you know you want to sell the fight you know i'm definitely sure that made it more interesting but um no not for me i feel as though it's not even i feel as though it's like this casey's been out here for years like years casey's not no no rookie Casey's been out for years, as long as some of the vets actually, but they still don't consider her top tier. That ain't my problem. It has nothing to do with anything I've said or anybody else. It's just her body of work for one. She's not memorable. She doesn't leave a lasting impression like a vet does. So that's why she hasn't, that's one of the reasons that I feel like she hasn't quite made that, that, that transcension and I mean the ascension into fucking top tierism, like for me, like. So a battle happening because someone says she that would never be the case with me. First of all, there's not too many other bitches I have left to battle. So everybody I have to battle now, if I decide to, because as you see, I just chilled. I think when people think that if they don't see me, it's so weird. If they don't see me, it's like I'm not getting called. But when these other bitches, they're taking breaks. No, 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 no. Don't ever get a fuck that my phone is always ringing. My inbox is always getting hit regardless if niggas want to say if I choke or not. Motherfuckers, don't give a fuck about that. And I'm not saying I don't, but people don't care about that. Like, damn, 40, like, you come. People see, like, yo, you're going to bring this amount of views or this amount of tickets to the situation. That's what people ultimately care about. It's fucked up. They want good battles, too, but that's not going to stop me from getting booked because I stumbled in a fucking battle or something. So I said all that to say the battle happened because it's something that just was in the, like, something that could happen. Like, I mean, it could have been coffee, but her and Hustle's going on. It could have been Vixen, if that's something I even showed any interest in. I could have said, no, I don't want Casey. I want Vixen instead or something. You think Vixen's gonna say no, she ain't gonna take me? Like, let's just start there. Like, I, 
guess when I talk my shit, I look like this stuck up, cocky ass bitch. But these other bitches talk that shit. It's like, yeah, talk that shit. You're hungry. You ready to take our head off? So it's just like, it's like a fucked up position to be in. You know what I mean? But I feel as though, let's not act as, let's not act like, like that bitch has to take me. You understand what I'm saying? Like, y'all can play around with shit like if you want to, but let's not act like a motherfucker called KCJ and she's like, hmm, let me think about taking 40 bars. That bitch is dying to take a bitch like me, for one. Not only because she might think that she could beat me, but for two, I'm that bitch that's in the class she wants to be in. So she's trying to get a seat at my table. So that bitch would never not take me. Do you understand what I'm saying? None of these bitches would never say no to taking me. So let them play around with you if they want to and the, the oh, 40's not this and 40's not that. These bitches, they're not gonna not take me if they call them. Like, are you crazy? So ultimately, it's up to, hey, 40, will you do this battle? Will you do this? Hey, we have Yoshi. Yo, we have Casey. Yo, we have Coffee. We have Vixen. Do you want this battle? Ah, uh, no. They're not. No, I'm not a bitch that they got to call me like, hey, will you do this? What the fuck? Mm -mm. So, no, nah, that's not why this battle happens. It's better happen because it's just one more battle to happen and because it's something that I show interest. And because you know what? When I, I it's one of I fucked up when I came off the stage battle and official talking shit. Like I'm gonna have to get one of these about being funny, like I'm gonna have to get Casey out of here. So that's what I get. Now they make it seem like I wanted it or like bitch I was just talking shit, but whatever. What what do you say to uh, anyone saying that you were hating because they were saying she's the face of female battle rap now. How come they not hating on me when people say good things about me and they say that I'm not? How right. come it's always me hating when I don't agree with something? Like these bitches, you can check my timeline. Plenty of them say I could be minding my business. Y'all da, 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 y'all ever seen 40? Why y'all still think 40? So I'm like, damn bitch, like what did we speak yesterday? Did I fuck you last night? Like what happened? And my whole thing is just like when I say, oh no, this bitch is not this 40s hand, why? Because I'm in a solidified position already. So I got to be hating because the bitch that's trying to come up to where I'm at is not doing what I think y'all are doing. The fuck out of here. No, absolutely not. I, but she can say how much I disappointed her, how much I'm not that bitch anymore, anything like that. How come that's not hating? How come she's not just respecting my fucking body to work or the 10 plus years that I put in this fucking game, things that she's never done? I don't give a fuck about a fucking ultimate madness tournament that you didn't win, bitch. You didn't win. Why the fuck do people want, like, why do we have to keep making fucking, um, it, like exceptions for females and shit bitch if you win you win y'all are giving her props for advancing in the tournament that's what the fuck you're supposed to do then the bitch gets creamed the one time let me stop let me stop because i'm not even a phony ass bitch like that the bitch lost geechee fucked her up i won't say creamed i won't say creamed because she actually did well but geechee was that much better than her that night he fucked her up period she did good she did good but she wasn't good enough and that's always been the problem with casey's career you have these battles you're not good enough you don't say anything memorable you don't have no fucking slogan, no tag, like nothing. Like, what are you doing? Like, what do you remember about KCJ? What? I wait. Besides, you're a Bardashian? Bitch, if you wasn't a Bardashian, we'd forget who you are. That was a good move for you. Getting close to some bitches who people always are talking about. Because they're not talking about you unless you're with them. You're in a tournament. Like, this shit, it's just, it's just, this shit's just crazy to me how motherfuckers want me to, to give praise to someone who, who lost. If that's the case, why aren't we big enough fucking Cortez, who was one of the biggest upsets in the tourney? He lost too. And went further than everybody else expected. What the fuck's the difference? Oh, because she's a female and I'm a female. I'm supposed to just be like, oh, let me give you extra props. Fuck, now I'll give the bitch props when she wins. And then if she won, if she won the tournament and I was talking shit, that would be hate. Do you understand what I'm saying? She didn't win. So I have to suck her off because y'all feel like she made, it was a start. Nah, fuck that. When I was watching the fucking tournament, which I enjoyed watching, when I saw her battle, I gave her props right then and there. I dropped a few props in the comments and I, hey, made the best person win. And that's what it is. I'm not going to be phony or fake like some, some, some fake show of female camaraderie that doesn't exist for the sake of you people not thinking I'm a hater. I don't give a fuck about that. I'm a grown-ass woman. I'm a very grown-ass woman, <laughs> clearly. So the fuck I look like? No, 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 no. You get, you get credit where it's due. You're a good rapper. You know what I'm saying? You've done your thing, but you haven't done enough of anything. For me to give you, for me to be like, oh, you're a face of anything. Like, what, like, I, I don't recall you doing, for me, no, no. Who, who would you consider to be the face of female battle rap right now? I don't, I don't even like that. Like, why does the face, like, does the face, how often does the face switch? Like, I don't even know how to answer that question. Right, because Geechee, they're saying Geechee is the face now. Rock used to be the face. Yeah, but if you think about it, if I could see that, I, that would make sense. But these, they've had reigns, though. Mm -hmm. Like, Geechee's been running the past two years almost. What, three years? He's been, he was champion two years in a row. That is a face. 
and you understand what I'm saying? Can win this and and is still in the saying. tournament. Like you understand what right. I'm saying? He has his own battle league. He's doing things. He's like that is a face of something. So I respect that. Even if they considered Tay Rock a face at one time, I get it. He was on every. He was the. He was one of Smack's favorite headliners. I get it. I feel like DNA's been a face at one time. If that's how we're going with people who've been um, monumental in the culture, then that's it. And if that's how we're scoring on the lady side, why would Casey go there? Because <laughs> she was in the tournament. If that yo, she was in the tournament. Official was in the tournament. They all typically lost. So does she get more points because she made it further than them? You made it further with p opponents who choked. The first person who actually rapped, you lost. I don't want to hear that shit. I don't want to hear none of that shit. Uh-uh. So call it hate, call it whatever you want. But for me, it's like a spade is a spade. You get props for winning. You don't if you lose. In between, any extra digging, digging and stuff like, okay, whatever. This is battle rap. It's a competitive sport we're gonna be catty petty and talk shit that's what we do we talk shit to each other as far as me being like oh you wait no i don't have time for that when the event was on i did a watch party and everything cheer for their good bars and everything like okay but at the end of the day you lost bitch am i supposed to be like act like you didn't because you're a woman because we both have vaginas that is the that we both battle rap we're black and we're women that is probably the extent of our similarities no fuck no Mm -hmm. on the 26 is she uh is she a good competition for you or do you think you can just walk through her how do you look at that battle going down no i definitely don't think i'm going to just walk through her but i don't think that it's going to be anything left when i'm done walking <laughs> you understand what i'm saying straight like that oh like i don't feel like she's gonna be a, a fucking Nah, yeah, I said it enough the first time. Nah, I don't think she's like a slouch. I don't think I've ever said that. I just don't think she's good enough. You're good, but you're not good enough. You be a six, you know what I'm saying? A seven sometimes, but you're not nine and a half. You're not ten. You're not hitting there. So like, no. Mm -mm. And I think the problem with her being so wrapped up in um, my poor performances with her, with her, with her friends, I feel like that shit really got her gas. I feel like she really feels like. Like there's some kind of curse or like I just can't beat these bitches. And I'm like, trust me, everyone to fucking bang my head against the wall. Like, yo, you really made it look like these bitches. Is <laughs> a Kardashian <laughs> curse. <laughs> yo, and I, I'm, yo, you I, you know, like I talk mad shit. Like I, I'm like, I have a very thick skin. You know what I mean? So I was like, damn, you stupid bitch. That's what you get. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I stopped going back and forth and arguing with people. Cause I'm just like, you know what? That's what you get. Cause you did that. Like you are prepared each fucking time like how can i argue with that with people each time all right whatever so moving forward i don't know why she would like not take that into consideration like all right i took official a month after i had to surf one of the biggest battles in my career i had official 30 days later so i'm not making no excuses like like she had a battle a big one too or whatever like that her preparation was different she does it a little bit more better than i do as far as preparing so her being able to deliver a clean performance and me, that was on me. Nobody's problem but mine's. But I say that to say there's been a five month gap between the last time I battled. I've never came back. I've never had a fuck up situation that came back with a vengeance. We've seen it two on two. We see what happened when I came back and battled her. So same thing when I battled. I mean, nobody gives a fuck about Lex Banko. When I lost to Jazz, came back and killed Lex Banko. Like, it's a different hunger. Um, when I feel like I have to prove myself. So I'm actually glad that Casey's lit in this fire underneath me because, um, yeah, because I, 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 I'm kind of, I've been ashamed of myself. You know, I read over the comments sometimes and I was watching some of my battles on my caffeine. It's just like, damn, 40, like, you really, you, you gave them rope to hang you. You know what I mean? You gave them like to stand on. So now I have to come back and um, mommy's back. I'm gonna come outside. Since bitches think that because I want to I wanna sit back and regroup for a little bit like they're the face of the culture. You have the biggest head in battle rap does not mean that you're the face of female battle rap. These are two different things. The fuck is wrong with these people? Like, I just... Yo. <laughs> I just be trying to make it make sense here. I just be trying to like make it make sense here. Like just here, here, and here. But what's, what's going to happen is this. That's how we're going to predict this. Casey thinks that she's going to beat me and get Vix on some of madness. That's what she thinks. Casey's going to get embarrassed on June 26th. There's going to be no call for some madness. 
whether or not I determine if I decide to take it or if they book me or not. That could be, I'm not really sure how that can go. URL, you know, they might book me, they might not. I don't know. I don't know. But I know they won't be booking Casey when I'm done with her. I know that's not going to happen. Um, I also know that we have we have these talks about like the woman of the year, the Woody and stuff like that. And I'm playing in my mind, I'm like, damn, what, what's been done? Who's really in the running for a situation? Hmm. Casey, because she was in the Ultimate Madness tournament and lost? That's my biggest competition? Okay. But it's still... Can I smoke? Sure. Oh, I don't know. You grown ass woman. No, I'm just saying, like, you might camera, be like on camera, like, you know what I mean? I don't know, nah. that, that messes up your monetization and you, like YouTube, that. they be picking and choosing what they want to fucking flag and shit. It's weird. I don't know why, but. Yeah. Um, right. um, I lost my train of thought. Because I have these long ass answers. No, not answers. at all. No, 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 no. I had it until you <laughs> asked me that. Because <laughs> it's just like. Let's just stop. Let's just stop. Well, well, I'm, I'm uh, now. Did was Casey J ever on your radar? No. Okay. Absolutely not. That's what That's I. That's why I really wish. Like I really wish. You ever speak too fast? I was like so. I'm not gonna hold you. I was so embarrassed that fucking up with official. Like I was just spewing anything out of my mouth. Like I really wish I didn't say that. Like I'm at the fuck up one of these Kardashian bitches. I was so embarrassed. Like I couldn't believe that I just did that again. So that's not making no excuses. But like I'm not these other bitches. I I can stand no shit that I say or that I do. You know what I mean? And that's what happened. I was I was embarrassed. Right. I'm just talking like nervous energy and it's just like oh, I gotta do the, just stupid shit. And I fucking now it looks like I wanted this bitch. Like Casey. Like I'm not trying to be funny. You've never been on my radar because you, what you gotta understand is this say what you may i've reached a certain level in female battle rap i have hit my ceiling in female battle rap the only thing i could do is go on like a streak of killer niggas and then they they might push me through the ceiling i might get to be upstairs for real like the guys you know what i'm saying outside of that there's no reason for these bitches to be on my radar it's not like i'm so hungry to just be out here battle battle rap and packing and racket I, I don't give a fuck about battle rap that much to be watching these bitches every day planning the next oh i'm gonna get her she's gonna come up i'm gonna fuck her up I don't care that much. I, I've been here too long. At this point, a bitch being on my radar is strictly about a bag or a prestige. And Casey can't help me prestige. In fact, my money's a little less thing in this battle. Like, it's just kind of like, we're not at the top of the card. Fucking with this bitch. Like, this is what I'm saying. It's like all a loss for me. It's all a loss for me. Casey's never been at the top of any card. Ever. Like, I, I just... Make it make sense that you're the face. Because the face don't have to ask for battles and tell bitches to come outside. Because when I was the face, which is definitely the consensus, regardless if it's gone or it was, right? I never had to call anybody out. There's only one person I ever said I want to battle, and that was Hustle. I didn't keep telling her to come outside. I didn't tweet niggas, ask me what I want to battle. I said that. She declined, and it waited until it was brought again. again. Like, it's like the desperation for me. Casey's like the little puppy that, like, in the pound. Like, you know when everybody's, like, touching, like, the Yorkies and stuff? Casey's like the little mutt that's just like me too though. I uh, me too. I can bark too. Me, arr, arr, look at me. <laughs> like, that's what she reminds me of. It's like the desperation for me. I'm a Bardashian too. <laughs> I'm from the South too. <laughs> I'm the fit. Like sit the fuck down, sis. When it's authentic and it's organic, people will crown you what your title is. You don't gotta tell people. Hey, it's my name. Talk to your case. What the fuck kind of clown shit is that? Fifteen minutes of fame. You are now listening. 15 minutes of fame, baby. Let's go!